Elon Musk has ignited a firestorm of controversy with his recent comments on social media platform X. The tech billionaire questioned why there are no threats against President Joe Biden and Vice President Kamala Harris, prompting the White House to label his remarks as irresponsible. Musk's comments came in response to news about an alleged incident involving former President Donald Trump during a golf outing in Florida. White House spokesperson Andrew Bates responded swiftly, emphasizing that violence should only be condemned, never encouraged, or joked about. The remarks drew immediate backlash from users across the political spectrum, with many denouncing Musk's statements as appalling. Conservative columnist Jonah Goldberg called the post appalling and indefensible, while comedian Maz Jobrani suggested that authorities should investigate. Musk eventually deleted the controversial post, admitting that his comments were poorly received and clarifying that he did not intend to be serious. This incident follows another recent controversy involving the New Hampshire Libertarian Party, which faced widespread condemnation for a provocative tweet regarding Vice President Harris. The debate over Musk's comments adds to ongoing tensions between the tech mogul and various governments worldwide. Just last week, Musk labeled the Australian government as fascists over proposed misinformation laws, leading to a sharp rebuke from Australian Prime Minister Anthony Albanese. The Australian government is exploring new measures to hold social media companies accountable for content on their platforms. As Musk continues to champion himself as a free speech absolutist, his confrontations with political figures and digital rights groups are raising questions about the responsibilities of social media platforms in moderating content and the impact of influential figures on public discourse.